if you live in a place, if you exist in a place, you should be doing something to have a positive impact on that place. So I was here at FNM and didn't feel connected to the community. I sought out really the only way that I thought I could have an impact, which was through exercise. And that's because I believed I can't leave Lancaster, Pennsylvania without doing something to make it better. So Benchmark Program has, has been my life's work, um, and really it's a connection method for at-risk teens and mentors. At FNM, I went abroad and I spent a month living in southern Chile uh, with an indigenous group of people. And when I was there, I was in the community and involved only in the community. There was nothing besides the community. So I got back to FNM and I felt a hole that had been filled by my time uh, studying abroad. And I thought, I have to be connected to the community where I live. Why can't I just do something now? That's how it started. So we created the gym setting, a weightlifting space for kids to come after school, work out, talk to mentors, and ultimately get advice. The first thing that I do when I have kids come down here to Benchmark is I just listen to them, showing them that I'm interested in them, which is the most powerful thing for them when they're coming here. My background is very different from the teens that I serve here in the city. We both look at each other and say, you know nothing about me. And that means immediately we've eliminated judgment. I, I, I have no basis to judge a teenager on. I don't understand what it's like to live in poverty, to have food scarcity and not know where a rent check is coming from or where we're gonna live. And they look at me and don't understand all the struggles that I've been through. I just enjoy learning about people. I'm curious about kids' stories. And through that curiosity, I'm able to uncover areas where I can have an impact. There are certainly fitness goals that we meet, but the true victories are in the classroom. And if they bring their grades up, improve their school attendance, there are people at school who will support them. My work is to just to build the confidence to say, if I work hard in school, just like I do in the weight room, I can be successful. I met my wife at FNM, and she's the reason why we're here today. She listened to me as I talked about my initial visions for the program that I'm now running, and she encouraged me from day one. I have an itch, a gut feeling, if you will, that tells me that there's, there's something else out there. There'll be something in the future that I feel called to in helping as many people as I possibly can, and feeling that at the end of the day, I've used up all of my energy in the service of others. And I don't know exactly what those future opportunities look like, but I can tell you that I'm open to them. <laughs>